Hello Kidlets, Mr. Flick here with MyTechBadges.com and welcome to another great tech badge. This one is called iPad Photography Level 2 Object Photography. All right, let's get right into it. Object Photography. What on earth is object photography? Well, that's everything besides people. People photography is what we're going to cover in Level 3 because they're very complicated. You have to get them to pose, do nice things, you know, that kind of weird stuff. Also, we're not talking about selfie photography. That's, again, taking pictures of people. It's everything else. Okay, we're going to build on all those things you learned in level one about how to use the camera, how to focus, and then we're going to now talk about how to compose great photos, how to make your photos look really, really good. We're going to go into some really cool challenges that are going to really push you in your artistic ability as a photographer, but by the time you're done level two, you're going to be like, yeah, look at me, great iPad photographer. This badge is really important because you as a student are going to use these skills for years to come. Okay, for the rest of your life. If you can master how to take photos, really good photos of all the things around you, it is going to make things so much better for you. And I'm not just talking social media and you know everybody posting every photo of everything they've ever eaten or done or things. And you know, and that's important because we need to document our lives. But I'm really talking your work as a student is going to really, I mean, you're going to be able, once you're done level two, your photos are going to look so good and you're going to put them on all your reports that you're going to hand into your teachers and, and your presentations that you're going to stand up in front of your classroom and do. And they are going to be exceptional because you always need to take photos of objects in your life. You need to take photos of science fair projects, of, of just your math work, of different objects to explain geometry and math. You know, all these things, or maybe a visual book report. All these things require great object photography skills, and that's why it's important that you do it. All right, let's talk about the things you're going to need for this badge. Now, in the past, level one, we just used the apps that came with your iPad, so the camera app and photos app. For this one, we're adding a paid for app. It's called Photo Toaster. You're going to need to download that one to your, your iPad. And you need, of course, to have a toy again. So, uh, you know, you've seen uh, Mike in some of my photos before. It's, you know, he just keeps showing up. So you need, a, you need to have a photo, I mean, sorry, you need to have a toy to take a photo of and some white paper. We do use that in one of the projects that you're gonna do, so that's really simple. Photo toaster, a toy, and some white paper. You've got this. All right, to earn this badge, you're gonna go through the tutorials and you are going to complete seven, seven different assignments. So. Photographers, that's how you work. You get photo assignments, okay? So get used to it if you're going to be a great photographer. But I've got these seven assignments that are going to show you and teach you how to take great object photos. Okay, so that's what the seven assignments are all about. You complete those, and then just like always, you have to do some projects in your classroom, do some things for your teacher. Once you got those two things down, and they look good, and you pass them off, then boom! Congratulations, you now have an iPad Photography Level 2 badge. Okay, for the impressive rating on this one, I'm going to give it, let's see, three grandmas. Because when you show your photos to grandma, she's going to be like, wait, these are really nice. Can you show me how to do that? And then you're going to have to show grandma all the cool things that you've learned. Uh, for the teacher rating, I'm going to give it four teachers. Because your teacher is going to really start appreciating the great photographer that you are. So they're gonna be like, yeah, I'm so glad that my kids are doing tech badges because look at these great photos. So I'm gonna give it four. And then your friends, finally, your friends are gonna to start to be impressed. I'm gonna give it three because, uh, you know, friends are hard to impress, but they're gonna be like, wait, why do your photos look so good? Yeah, so that's how it's gonna be for this one. All right, have fun with this badge. Uh, if you've come here on YouTube and none of this makes sense, then you need to go over to my website, www.mytechbadges.com. That's where everything's organized. It has all the videos in a, you know, in a nice linear uh, fashion, so you can go from one to another, and also some other things that I put on my website. So make sure to head over to there. Uh, if you're on YouTube, make sure also, before you head over to my website, to subscribe, because that really helps me out. So uh, don't forget to subscribe to it. And I will see you in 
uh, lesson two, which we're going to go over some of the great things that I've been getting in my email from students all around the world. And let's see what photographs they're able to take. This is really good because you want to be able to see it before you get right into it. Maybe this isn't the badge for you. Maybe you really want to see what other kids have done. And then you'd be like, hmm, yes, I want to do this one or eh, maybe I'll go on to robotics. No, I don't know what you're talking about. So anyhow, I will see you in lesson two. Thank you.